Despite the tumultuous stock market atmosphere that has gloomed over the tech sector in the past couple months, which has struck both Intel and AMD with particular ruthlessness. Fresh sales figures indicate that the smaller of the two players not only had a far better luck in November than its much bigger rival, but also it in fact had a history making and record breaking month. Thanks to the incredible data transparency of Germany's largest e-tailer, MindFactory.de, and the incredible effort by the AMD community to collect and graph the data, we've had the privilege to gain deep insight into the PC market performance every month, and November was no exception. So let's get straight to the numbers. For every one processor that Intel sold at MindFactory DE last month, buyers purchased approximately two AMD processors. In terms of volume in the same month, buyers purchased more than 16,000 AMD processors via the German e-tailer, nearly double the amount compared to the same month last year, and by far the largest volume of processors ever sold at the e-tailer in any given month. Probably a big portion of that was thanks to deep discounts given throughout November. However, Intel sold less than half its rival's amount at just a little under 8,000 CPUs, which is around the same figure for the company at the same month last year. This indicates that the momentum shift in favor of AMD is largely due to considerable growth in the company's sales rather than a decline in Intel sales. Best-selling CPU for the AMD Ryzen lineup was the Ryzen 5 2600, followed by the Ryzen 7 2700X, the Ryzen 5 2600X, and finally the Intel Core i7-8700K secured fourth place over at MindFactory DE. When broken down by revenue generated instead of units sold, the situation improves marginally for Intel due to its significantly higher pricing structure. Although, AMD still commands the lion's share of revenue with a record-breaking 3 plus million euros generated in November, the largest figure ever recorded by Manfactory.de, even when compared to Intel's best performance last year in December. Nearly half of all CPUs sold at the e-tailer in the last month were second-generation Pinnacle Ridge AMD Ryzen CPUs, constituting 47% of unit share. In second place is Intel's Coffee Lake, with a little less than half of that at 22%. Although again, thanks to significantly higher pricing, Intel's share of the revenue is noticeably larger than its share of CPUs sold. All in all, November was a record-breaking month for the small Sunnyvale chipmaker, and it has remained a decent one for its much larger rival despite its ongoing production difficulties. If this momentum for the red team holds up, we could see even more records broken by the end of the year. Now it's important at the end of the day to remember that this isn't limited to one German retailer for numbers sake, so that's something to keep in mind. But what do you think about this? Is this indicative of what you've seen in your day to day with people that you know? Let us know down in the comment section below. Now this has been Keith with WCCF Tech TV. Make sure that you're subscribed and hit that notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.